Hey, and welcome to this uh, another video about um, Visual Basic 2008. Um, as you may know, I actually don't know if you saw that tutorial, but I made a tutorial on how to make an advanced um, login system in Visual Basic 6.0. So, uh, let's see, there it is. Somewhere, no, yes, here. Oh, damn it. Page two, okay. Here, advanced login system. How to make one? Um, but this involves the um, the <coughs> uh, how do you call it? The uh, the open open file thingy, so it can read it. And I think, uh, or I know, uh, some of you don't know the uh, code of the. Visual Basic Translate. So I'm going to make a tutorial on that one. So I'm going to add, uh, oh, or I mean, I uh, make a Windows uh, Forms application. Press OK. I call it log login. <coughs> so, um, oh, okay, that's right. I think. So let's make it more like that. Okay, so I go to the properties, <laughs> change the form one to login, uh, make it a fixed single, and minimize box uh, true, but the maximize box is false. So now we have this. Now I'm going to add two buttons and two text boxes. Just leave the name like that if you want to, and two labels. So, so you have to align the text boxes with the te the text of the text boxes with the uh, text of the labels. So, like that. Uh, this is just big enough, I think so. So remove uh, move this one like that. <coughs> so now we can make it a little bit uh, smaller. Okay. So go to button one and type in login and this one to uh, let's say um can so label 2 will be the password so password so now i have to make it a little bit smaller and then a colon behind it and label 1 is going to be user name oh like that yeah that's right okay so I go to cancel because that's the easiest code and that is and or me dot close and <coughs> now uh, now uh, go to the uh, password text box and go uh, find uh, let's search for password char and add a asterisk in there uh, that means it will replace every um, ch character character whatever you want to call it in this text box is going to masked with a asterisk mm. or if I put in D it will only show D but I use asterisk and so now I'll go to log on and I'm going to type in them uh, wait a second them user name as new system this is a uh, be sure you just uh, know this code because this is the one of the importance and this is going to be read it uh, the read file so system dot io dot stream reader not writer but reader and then a, a bracket and then I'm going to type in the um, Visual Basic uh, 2008 uh, code for the application dot path so I'm going to type in curd here that means current directory and then tag o slash and let's see text box one dot text and the extension and that is going to be dot txt for this one txt okay now do the same with the password so password 
as new system dot io dot stream reader current year current directory and that same slash slash and text box one two dot text I mean and dot dot txt wait a second I'm going to remove this one lol okay I'm sorry so now I'm going to type in dim user name two comma pass word as string then <coughs> username two equals to user name dot read line and then close it like that now pass word equals to user name dot read line and then user name dot close of course now once we have done that I'm going to type in um, if um, user wait a second if pass word equals to text box two dot text then oh <coughs> then oh then then uh, let's see message box well come space or uh, comma space and user name to else message box wrong password oh password like that <coughs> so now I go back to the first line and go to on air go to a now exit the sub a oh sub now a is message box um user does not exist like that okay so let's test it out oh so I'm going to type in D and the as you can see it's an as asterisk so log in and now it says user does not not does not exist <coughs> so um, I go to the folder where I just going to save it is this save now go to that directory um here's login okay login and then go to bin and then debug now i'm going to make a user let's call this one um hello and then i'm going to type in hello youtube like that and save it now run it again hello and it was you chew welcome hello so it works um, when I um, remove something it will say uh, wrong password and else it will say uh, that it doesn't exist so you can do the same with this um, so you have to um, add a new form and copy all those elements in but then make a create button and then instead of use uh, a stream writer type in stream writer and uh, I think you can do that for yourself find it out and stuff like that uh, so I hope you enjoyed this video also I hope you learned something in this video um, so feel free to comment rate subscribe PM me uh, whatever you want to do to contact me so uh, please subscribe it keeps me motivating to add uh, uh, upload more videos or make more videos about Visual Basic. Um, maybe there are coming some more Visual Basic 6.0 tutorials but I really don't know. 
So, thanks for watching again, and I'll catch you later.